Well, am I going to get into this school? Am I going to get this job? So we take that, put it in a pack. Who we might get married, start getting anxious about how those kids are going to turn out. And then along comes a pandemic. How is this going to play out at my works? Will I have enough medicine, have enough food and essential resources that I need? This is the picture of us. Do you, do you feel like this sometimes? Therefore, I tell you, do not be anxious about your life, what you will eat or what you will drink, nor about your body, what you will put on. Is not life more than food and the body more than clothing? Jesus says three times, do not be anxious. Just think about those three things Jesus mentions there. Food, drink, and clothes. And those are pretty basic needs, right? Like if you're gonna worry about anything, it seems like these would be at the top of the list. So why not worry about them? So your life is about more than what you eat or what you drink or what you wear. And when you realize that, you realize now you can put anything this world offers you in this sentence. Your life is about more than what school you get into. Your life is about more than what job you have. Your life is about more than how much money you make. Anxiety is carrying concerns about these things in this world in ways that lose perspective on what your life is ultimately about. Now, how do you have peace in the middle of a pandemic? Jesus says, behold the birds. No bird is worried about what's coming next. Why not? Because the birds know that God will provide for them. And if they know that, Jesus says, you can know that. Because you are more valuable to God than birds. You are God's prized creation. You are eternally valuable to God. Like life is challenging enough as it is. Why weigh yourself down with worry on top of everything else? If you don't know God as your father, you have a lot of reason to be anxious. But if you do know the God who is in control, if you know his goodness and his greatness and his wisdom and his mercy, and you not only know about him, but you actually know him as your Father in heaven, a relationship with God as dad, and you know that he values you as his child, if you know this, then you have no reason to be worried. Right now or at any time, my anxiety is for unbelievers in this sense, not for believers. Anxiety is a sign of unbelief in God, not of belief in God.